my dear Aquarius, hello, how are you? Welcome to your reading. My name is Sabbath. Welcome to Sabbath Zero. This is going to be your reading for the month of October. We're going to be tapping on to see what the messages are from the spirit for you, Aquarius. So let's begin your reading and see. Spirit, what does Aquarius need to know right now? May we know. That everything will be okay. Some of you, I'm feeling the need to say that to you. Everything will be okay. Don't be stressed out about the outcome of things, okay? Don't pressure yourself. So we have the Four of Clubs as your first card. Right off the bat, I heard invitation, a date. There is definitely this energy of courtship. Some of you are going to be invited somewhere. Or there's a person that really wants to meet you. That really is looking forward to seeing you, meeting with you. This could be a love interest for a lot of you or someone who's trying to actually build a firm foundation with you, get closer with you. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Um, some of you could be connecting with a water sign or fire or they could have these within their chart as well. But um, wow. Look at how many people there are in your reading. There could be more, more than just one person who really is wanting you or desiring you or some of you could be really thought about right now. I'm also hearing online some of you could have a lot of people checking you out. I don't know if you post pictures or you have some kind of a presence, but I do see this in your reading. Um, Aquarius, I do feel like in terms of your home, some of you could be relocating within the next four months. Um, specifically for the next year, I'm seeing a lot of like around your birthday season i'm seeing a lot of stability and you already settling it could be that some of you could be even settling down or moving in with a person here that um really wants to be close with you like i keep seeing this energy of closeness warmth i'm paying attention to this card there is a person who could really make you happy um <laughs> who could actually feel that you're shy or you kind of hide your feelings. Um, so maybe there's a strong energy of smile and eye contact. So it could be that whoever that you're connecting with really wishes to make you smile or make you happy um, or they wish to actually see you maybe smile more. I just get a lot of happiness with this energy, but we're going to see if there's any more messages before I do your other spreads. So let's see if I dear Aquarius. I just heard that's it. You're about to create a very special bond with someone. And the more they see you, the more they get used to you is the message that I'm seeing. You could be actually having a very emotional effect on this person. You could be connecting with a water sign. Again, it's coming through air as well as here. But as you can see how he's keeping her company, I feel like a lot of you... There's a person who could be a great listener, who could want to listen to you, keep you company... You could have even actually opened up to this person in regards to yourself as well. Um, but there's definitely a person who really wishes to be there for you strongly. Aquarius is something I'm noticing in your reading, honey. Wow. Did you see that light? <laughs> it just came back on. Okay, so let's see. I'm being called to actually go with different set of cards that I have for you. So we're going to do that. Don't be afraid to open up is what I just heard for you, Aquarius. Don't be afraid to open up your heart. You are being protected, okay? It's okay to open your heart and be vulnerable. You don't have to be necessarily guarding your heart 24-7 is what I just heard. I just heard I want to lie down next to you. Someone could have a person who wants to lie down next to you or be close with you, protect you. Very emotional, sensitive energy. The warrior. Yeah, some of you, I really feel like you're, you know, all your life for, for the past few years, you might have been either alone or you might have been feeling as if you're the one always taking care of yourself. When the reality is there are people here that wish to be there for you. I'm channeling the song Pink Champagne by Lana, specifically that part of the song that says, uh, you know, you don't know how good people can be. So some of you definitely have to cultivate this idea that there are people that really would 
be there for me or watch out for me. I don't know if you got hurt by a very close person to you. Some of you might have like got, I just heard the word venom in my head. You might have like felt like a person who was close um, did you wrong or you might have been backstabbed by a particular energy and the spirit here is telling you, hey, you know, you are becoming aligned with people that really wish to be there for you. Yeah, the heart, citizen and the scientist. You could be connecting with someone who works into healthcare, I just got some of you, or you could be also practicing, I just heard practitioner, you could be also in the process of learning, studying something, maybe honing your skills about something. The spirit here is saying that you have every tool to make something possible. Um, but I keep seeing this energy who's hovering around you that is specifically wanting to open your heart. You know, it's almost like they're tapping and knocking on your heart and saying, hey, Aquarius, I'm here. You know, you can come out or... Uh, it's also very childlike to me. So you could be connecting with someone who's very playful, perhaps. Okay, somebody who wants to, <laughs> yeah, make you happy. Spare, what is the outcome and what's going to be happening for the month of October for Aquarius? I just heard you're going to see someone more and more. So there's a lot of like seeing, meeting up energy coming in, company energy. Could also have lovers from left, left to right like approaching you you could have people approaching you ace of diamonds wow you're pulling a lot of aces which is speaking of new beginnings definitely yeah there's a strong energy of new beginning within your life and there's a strong sense of manifestation here some of you i definitely feel like you might have been manifesting a lot within your life or you might have been focusing on drawing i just heard drawing yeah some of you could be painting or you could be artistic in any kind of a field but for me to hear drawing it's, it's almost like you are creating your life the way you want or you're manifesting the changes that you wish to make to your life and no longer holding back I just really sense this energy of fearless artist with you. You know, some of you, if you're artists, maybe you need to be fearless about following your dreams, pursuing your dreams, starting something up, putting yourself out there, exposing yourself. Because, I mean, a, a part of an artist's work and success has to do with exposure and vulnerability. And as much as you try to protect it, as much as you might try to filter your emotions, you might not... Um, reach the potential that you're actually wanting to reach, right? So for a lot of you, I don't know why that message is coming through, but that definitely could be a spirit's advice to you, a channeled message for those of you that are intuitive, spiritual, all right, and artistic. But I'm seeing money coming through. Some of you could be actually having money, like uh, to purchase something maybe there are purchases here that you're making or just also speaking of a move particular move but um money wise everything's looking good for you i'm also seeing investing energy so you could be investing into something as well some of you or you could be partnering up with someone here that yeah i'm hearing take a risk don't be afraid Some of you I'm hearing, do not delay your plans. I don't know what that means, especially if you feel like you want to do something. Don't delay it. Just go for it. All right. Dear, dear Aquarius Spirit. Yeah, great messages coming through. Messages do we have for Aquarius? Yeah, there, there's definitely a lot of manipulation that you're letting go of. Some of you, I don't know if you recently cut an energy off. This is also speaking of people that just bring nothing but drama, you know, or unhappiness to you. I really feel like there's an energy of you setting yourself free and connecting with people that really have the capacity to love you, you know, that are um, meaning no harm to you. And the way you're noticing this is by how much they do for you, how much they listen to you, how much they're there. Strong water energy in your reading, okay? some of you earth as well here is coming through in fire but um specifically i feel that you're weighing down your options aquarius and you're going with the one that feels the most secure to you 
okay is the message but i need more information about that there could also be a father figure who wishes to help you or who's watching up for you there's also this energy of inheritance for you as well coming through some of you if there's been also separation with a family member i feel like they're wanting to connect with you like if somebody was mean to you i almost feel like they wanted to connect with you mm -hmm. somebody also is actually uh i just heard in pain in vain and pain that you're now a missed opportunity to them mm -hmm. you're really thinking for yourself and the spirit here is saying as long as you know that there's a lot of blessings always surrounding you and you're never starving yourself in that way you're always thinking that you're confident that you're beautiful that you're gorgeous it's really all coming down to your mindset right so i don't know if you separated yourself from an energy okay lately or this is also speaking of you becoming independent from an energy maybe some of you actually also moved away from a person that could be a possibility but you take as it resonates of course but the energy that i'm seeing here is that you're no longer giving to a person because you're realizing that it was not reciprocal um yeah so let's see more about this here if there's any other messages I really sense this presence in your reading Aquarius and this could be someone that's like okay you know sit down I'll take care of you you don't have to do a thing I'll be there for you there's just a very caring energy and this person could also cook or be good at cooking or they could maybe take you out to eat I don't know why I just heard that I'm a very loving person it feels too good to be true but it's actually not <laughs> any animal spirit messages spirit do we have for our dear yeah why not wow you're attracting a lot of good energy around you i don't know if you're aware of this but i'm seeing a strong energy socializing some of you could be actually entering a new job environment or this is also speaking of you having more presence somewhere and you being recognized let's say maybe online but it has to do with your uh, life purpose it has to do with something that's calling you and the more you're going to be actually planting the seeds for this uh, I just heard the book, The Alchemist, is coming through. Some of you maybe read that book. That could definitely be a, an omen from the spirit to come through this reading. But um, you need to be able to follow your heart because as long as you do, the right people are going to be by your side. And some of you, I'm also hearing you're teaching people how to respect you by respecting yourself. You know, it's like crossing, by crossing the boundaries, you are um, perhaps telling people that um, they need to respect you. There's something with the energy of self-respect and self-belief that's coming through your Aquarius that I'm sensing in your reading. Yeah, you have a person here who might have been going through depression because of you or because of the separation between you two. Some of you is what I just heard. And I don't speak this way usually. But there's a person who might have been feeling really in the dark because of you or because of you two parting ways maybe so is there any love messages before i do um angel spread i mean this is angel spread but we're gonna see if there's any more messages for you coming through <laughs> we have so many cards yeah there could be definitely more than maybe one person here okay i don't know if a person kind of wanted you to be all theirs but at the same time they weren't really putting as much effort but i feel like a lot of you are freeing yourself from something that was not moving that was not growing into something that you wanted it to be maybe some of you even stayed for a very long time and then you realize you know what it's time for me to go because it's not growing um you're forgiving this and you're freeing yourself from something there's also this message that do not hold back okay communicate what's on your mind if you need to get something off your chest do so okay uh, especially if you are if you're not used to speaking up for yourself if you're not used to confrontation some of you i'm needing to say emotionally speaking you might need to really speak up about something that's been on your mind or that's been bothering you that you might have been bottling up 
Um, but with this heavenly energy, the spirit here is telling you that you're calling in a lot of goodness in your life, blessings in your life, and people that put in the effort that see you, that wish to help you. A lot of co collaboration energy keeps coming through in your reading. So for a lot of you, I feel that, of course, you could be connecting with people that um, wish to collaborate with you. Yeah, it's like they see your potential and they see how able you are and they want to collaborate. Mm -hmm. You're definitely, <laughs> you're just definitely spot on intuitively. Like you're very intuitive. I'm not even kidding. You're very intuitive. Some of you, I, it's going to sound really specific, but some of you, it's like the more you detach yourself from an energy, the more you were able to kind of see things clearly. Or like once you stopped maybe living with someone, I don't know, there's something about you having your own space and you being able to think more clearly when you're in your own space. It's like you found yourself, you became stronger, you came back to yourself. So I don't know whose message this is, but this this definitely could have to do with like, you having your own space, you being able to grow um, where you feel safe growing, you know? And this definitely could have to do with your home situation or you wanting to relocate, you, um, yeah, maybe separating again. You take definitely take as it resonates and let me know what this is speaking of. Something near Easter might have happened for a lot of you. Um, I'm also hearing late spring, okay? Something might have happened, yeah. I feel like you're a very independent person. Some of you could even be a loner or you care a lot about your independence. And the spirit here is telling you that, yeah, you're not supposed to be doing too much, basically. You don't have to be so uh, rather caught up with pleasing someone and be losing yourself to a situation. Yeah. Is there any angel messages we have for our dear Aquarius? that we have yeah i love that <laughs> let's see do you have any angel messages we have within the next few months for you so within the next few months whatever this change may be is coming through and i feel like for, for a lot of you this has to do with success the energy of level up glow up something finally coming together that you've been waiting for a yes answer for sure. And the spirit is asking you, you need to remain positive and believe in yourself. Okay. For sure is the energy. Yeah, big happy changes. There you go. <laughs> I love that. Positive recognition. Number 19 could be significant. Congratulations. Your plans have worked out perfectly and now it's your time to shine. Brilliant new ideas will present themselves to you and success is all but assured. Express yourself openly and honestly, knowing that those surrounding you are trustworthy. Be open to unexpected opportunities. This definitely could be the same energy that came through within the beginning of a reading that I told you that somebody here wants to be a helping hand to you. Um, and the spirit is asking you, there are helpful people out there that wish to help you. And it's just a matter of you being open and communicative. Okay. Because, yeah, for some reason, some of you, I feel like either you're used to hiding, like, how you feel or hiding your pain or hiding something that's on your mind. And uh, I don't know if it's because you felt judged in this situation. You felt like somebody couldn't help you or wouldn't listen to you. Maybe this was your household or your childhood. I don't know. But the spirit is really telling you, feel free to speak up. Feel free to communicate. Feel free to open up and express right? As the message for strong energy through chakra and heart chakra and even sacral is coming through. Um, so this is what I have for you, my dear Aquarius. So let me know what you think. I'm sending you my kiss. Mm -hmm. My warm, my love and light. Take good care and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, honey.